I have been uh, in land use science for all of my career and also did a lot of uh, policy work uh, in Europe, but also globally and elsewhere. Um, we, uh, on the science side, and uh, me in particular, I uh, ramped up uh, global but also local models uh, that feed into the IPCC assessment of 1.5 uh, degrees. And what we see there is that uh, um, uh, carbon from forests uh, actually play play a huge role, not only, and this was discussed already in terms of, uh, of biomass use, but also in terms of overall carbon management in order to lead to our final goals of net zero and 1.5, uh, but also for biodiversity and uh, in all of the material uh, values, uh, which were also discussed already. So, so here, what we see in all of those scenarios, for example, uh, the global uh, goal of reaching 1.5 degrees uh, and the Paris Agreement without biomass uh, currently is actually unthinkable. So here, uh, biomass definitely, uh, especially biomass combined with uh, carbon capture and sequestration, is one of the key technologies we know of today to actually ensure that we we, we reach those those targets, um, not only technically but also economically.